Hello, and welcome to Miss Rogers' Wonderful School Story Corner. Today, your eyes will be in for a treat, a sumptuous treat, because this selection has the most beautiful illustrations that are made with collage. And we are going to be reading The Moon is Going to Addie's House, written and illustrated by Ida Pearl. Addie, your play date is over, calls Mama. It's time to go home. Papa's waiting at the car. The moon is waiting above him. And off we go. Look way up high. And way down low. There it is, Phil. The moon is following us. Across the bridge as the sun sets. Roll down the windows and breathe deep. I've caught it. But only for a moment. And peeking through clouds, Where did it go? Oh, now I know. The moon was going to my house. It waited to light up my nighttime dance. It waits and watches over me. Always. The moon is going to Addie's house by Ida Pearl. I used to read this story quite often when I was reading stories at the Bank Street Bookstore for Children and Educators. And I'm just gonna take a moment right now to say that the Bank Street Bookstore has closed and it's very sad for, for me, of course, because I was a resident storyteller there, but it's sad for all of you, all of you avid readers and wanderers and parents and teachers, educators from all over the world, children from all over the world would come and I would read to them. And now I'm reading to all of you. It's my way of keeping the tradition going. So I remember this book fondly with a lot of many of the books that I've been reading to you here at the wonderful school. And some of the books actually have come from my very own daughter's library. She's no longer your age, but 
she is still a wonderful, avid reader. So thank you so much for coming to Miss Rogers' Wonderful School Story Corner. Have a wonderful afternoon and an even nicer tomorrow. Bye-bye now. <laughs>